From Cape Town to Bayern Munich, yo, hey, Tina Sobavala. Anytime we day, your mother kill him with the champion sound. Tina Sobavala. Me represent books, chronicle and sound rules, world fire can cool. Sobavala. Anytime we day, your mother kill him with the number one sound. Tina Sobavala. We represent books, chronicle and sound rules, world fire can cool. POC actually were the, they were the guys that were actually like touring, the, touring not the country but overseas because they got banned if you remember because of the content in their music. They were the they were the ones that were actually they, they are I, I would say they were they are one of the founders and pioneers. You know what I'm saying when it comes to um, Cape Town hip hop. You know there are artists uh, groups like Black Noise who also existed in the 80s. You know like shout out to Emil, you know and all the other members. You know uh, they, those are the guys that I I can say you know. In, in the Cape Flats, they were like really pushing hard, you know. I can't really recall in the 80s, you know, in the township, you know, whether there was any rap group or hip hop group or reggae group or I raga think, group. I think we were more jazzy than that. It was more, it was more jazzy, exactly, jazzy. exactly, exactly, you know. But uh, yeah, those are the guys, you know, that really ac actually established, you know, a foundation, you know, for, for us yeah. and for, for others, you know, not only us, you know what I mean. And, Big respect to them, you know. Uh, big up to Shaheen, you know, from POC, you know, good friend of mine. And, uh, you know, also Prasafani Cup, you know. Yeah, so big up to those guys. I can I can never let, I can never, you know, uh, put them out in, in the history of never. You know, if you if you do that, you must, something must be wrong with you. Exactly, man. Quadessa, you know, like, I think they are, they are one of the, what they are or were, one of the most outstanding female hip hop groups, not in South Africa, but in the continent. There is not even one hip hop group that exists till today, you know. I felt so sore when, you know, they had disagreements and they split, you know what I'm saying? I feel like, the, I mean, I, had, I have songs, you know, with them. You know, I have songs, you know, they are my good friends, Bernie Aman, you know, EJ Von Lyric, who's currently in the Netherlands and Shamima was in, in Canada, you know. They are, you know, they were, they, I, I really feel like, please sisters, I don't know, like, please, one day if you could try and come together, you know, resolve the issue, you know what I mean? You guys were like representing not just the country, but the continent at large, you know, respect, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah shout out to Planet Earth, man. That's like, that's my, you know, we come from the same school, you know, him and me, you know, we, the first instrument we had was a was a, something that we thought was a calculator that some rude boys were selling. Again, ghetto drama. Some rude boys just came, yo Rasta, we know so, that you know, you, you guys, you gotta know how this thing works, man. You gotta know how this thing, check this out. So I look at this thing, I think, no man, this thing looks like a calculator because it's got these pads, you know? And then we're thinking, okay, wait guys, let's test it out. It's got this audio output jack. We put it in a mixer and when you hit this, calculator looking like button, there's a kick coming out and you hit the next one as a hi-hat and the next one is a snare. Oh, whoa, whoa. This, is, this is something. And we see a record button and a play button. That definitely means that you can be able to make a beat. We bought the machine and that's where we all started feeling around the same machine, trying to figure out, you know, like how does it work? How does it, you know, how you, how you construct it. That's actually how I got to learn how to use an MPC because I only got to use an MPC about four years ago at the, at the Red Bull Studios. And when I, when I had my, my hands on it for the first time, it was like, this thing looks complicated, you know? But then I had to like look at it like, like into detail, you know, like attentively. Then I discovered, no, this thing works similar to the machine that we had like 10, almost 10 years ago, you know what I'm saying? You use one button and another button in order to function. One button and another, there's a shift button, and you know? And that's how I learned to use an MPC, you know? So, like Dre, Dre is a, like I said, Dre is a, he's, he's, a, he's a genius when it comes to production, you know? Yeah. Oh yes, now it comes to mind. You ask me who, which artist would I, like, uh, yeah. yeah. Your, your favorite at the moment. At the moment, I, I, think, I think Youngster. Youngster, Youngster is a, yeah, Youngster is, that is a guy, that is, now that is a artist, that is an artist, like somebody who works in the craft, you know, not some, 
Some guy who says they, they're an artist. And then this guy worked 25 mixtapes. Who the hell got 25 mixtapes in, in the whole of South Africa? But again... Um, Nobody recognizes. Exactly. Ay, 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 ay. It's, it's, it's like uh, you don't understand. Like, it's crazy. Uh, <laughs> it's crazy. It's crazy. The guy is, is young. Yeah. And 22 only. When you listen to his music, it's social issues. He's supposed to be right there, man. You know? We had a, we were touring last year in Joburg at the Red Bull Base Camp. And we were like most of the time together, you know? And it was the first time to have a more close encounter with him. You know what I mean? And I, I, I found him to be very much of a... You know, he's like... A yeah, very mature guy. Yeah. He's actually, you know what? I don't care whether the youngster hears this or not, man. This guy is old for his age, man. Tell him that, because you know? I said exactly the same thing. He's, he's, <laughs> he's, he's old for his age. I mean, for somebody who's 20... I'm, I'm, I'm 10 years older than him. You know what I'm saying? But, like, the way he, he gets to... I get to pay attention to his music, man. Like, it's, it's out of this world, you know what I'm saying? So it just shows that, you know, like, age age ain't nothing but a number, man, you know? Yeah, age ain't nothing but... And also, talent has nothing to do with age. <coughs> nothing to do with age, you know? Yeah. So, Youngster is my man. That's my man. And we need to jump on the track. <laughs> we need to jump on the track. That's what we've been talking about it. Let's jump on the track. Let's jump on the track. But I guess we're both busy. He's busy with this thing. I'm busy on my hustle. You know, it's not it's not always easy. Yeah, yeah. Don't be an obstruction or else you could be dead. Yo, too much shutters and they get out while you walk in at the slums. Now full of sounds are echo. If you want to survive, you have to push a little muscle. You have to be street smart, that's part of the hustle.